how person go they chop sand unzu kalaba kalaba chop kalaba stone a lot of people they chop stone kalaba sand we they call them geophagia the act of eating clay and this video i won't tell you whether it's good or bad a lot of babies now a lot of oh baby they go vex for me but i will tell you the truth number one who they do am? most people they do am all over the world most times if they they come on for women past men children they do am past adults woman we get belly they do am past woman we no get belly yes and people where they do am they know they like talk am they, they hide their mouths they know they talk i see somebody where they chop clay the person they chop and in mama and papa no no and this thing give them big problem research don't tell us say inside this your stone where they chop your clay you get what you they call heavy metals these heavy metals things like arsenic this thing a heavy metal things like lead all these things they inside even some kind of infection and they inside warm infection they inside the clay where you they chop and if care is not taken you they chop this thing oh baby it go give you problem it go spoil your body now some people go tell you say a lie what are you saying it has benefits that was in the olden days say um, if you chop them as a pregnant woman you know go make you vomit and say if you chop them it go help your belly all those things now before before now research don't show say this thing can give you problem even your picking for your belly your picking go collect all these things go affect your picking they play you don't know now there's a big problem in you know, the cause what do they call addic addiction people where they chop this stone they don't come get community where they're there among themselves they chop them they suffer so let me tell you what can happen to you if you they chop unzu number one you can have what we call nutritional deficiency nutritional problem why this thing where you they chop this heavy metals they feel make your body your body no go fit absorb all the nutrients where you need you can they get deficiency in iron deficiency in zinc and all the nutrients you go suffer malnutrition everybody go they heal you oh baby but you are what you are suffering now if woman get belly where should they chop all these things what can happen this heavy metals fee affects your picking for your picking brain and that's on period yes your picking brain go come they get problem your picking no go even they grow well what do they call i u g r intrauterine growth restriction it can happen to your pekin oh baby if you give your pekin what will they call low birth weight when you born your pekin oh baby your pekin go collect and um, but you want to tell me i beg joe i have been eating this thing since for a long time nothing do me no worry <laughs> they play when the problem starts later later for life no cry yo no cry another problem that can happen to you it can give you warm infection you can't they pack warm inside your body you not go know say you they feed your body with warm <laughs> another problem it can give to you can give you anemia low blood you get one person where i know you watch this video what's it happen say my body they weak my body they weak i they told me every time every time we can't they think we can't find out to get blood for body check 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 everything they okay they give her medicine. They take medicine. You know they work. And they tell you true life story. Oh, I can't they say they go, they go. They can't give blood. They gave three units of blood. That is, what do they call blood transfusion? Yes, it was so bad. Now you can't say, Dr. Fred, oh, let me confess. And my people don't know. My mommy no know. My daddy no know. My all, everything no know, no know. He say, I they chop clay. You say I feel you can do food in a day. I'm not going to chop any food. Now only clear I go chop. Blood can go down. I mean everything is okay. Then do all tests. Now this one. Now we can't find out. I can't the beggar. Stop now. No, they do this thing again. It goes spoil your body. Oh, if you see me for the first time, 
My name now, Dr. Frederick Kunubohai. I be licensed medical doctor. I be make health videos as simple as ABC for you to understand. Make it not on your brain. For here, now teach and teach. I know they give my number. I know they private chat anybody. I know they call people for internet. I beg go. I know they do WhatsApp chats. So if you have any medical problem, I beg of you, please go to the hospital. Speak with your doctor. Make them treat you. Here, now teach as they teach. They follow me, I'll be very good. Another problem, if it happen to you, you feel get intestinal obstruction. Inside your belly, your belly feel come block. Feel get what we they call constipation. Yes, you know go feel go toilet, go even caca again. If care is not taken, you can enter operation because of this clay where you chop. These are some of the problems. Now I know you, yes, you, fine girl. You are angry. Shut up. What do you know? What are you saying? No vex. No vex. Continue. But remember that when the problem comes, start. I won't beg you. No disturb your family. Yo. This is please. Now only you go suffer ammo. Just day your day. So that when you suffer well, well, you can't confess. At that time, you can't say, okay, true, true. May we help you. But right now, I beg you, stop them because of this thing. A lot of people are addicted to it. Parents, call your Pekin, ask them, my Pekin, you they chop sand, leave sand alone, no chop sand. If you never follow me, click on the follow button. Share this video, make our people know, say, Unzu no good for body. Yes, research has shown that it is bad in the body. Stop to the chop Unzu. Be clear, Abi, no clear. Put them in the comment section. Don't forget, like this video, share this video. I always tell you, good life now waiting, good life. Now, sense so.